Welcome to our lecture online. In this example, we may finally break the mystery of what a line integral is. We're going to try to find the mass of a wire which is bent into the shape of a semicircle. Notice that the density of the wire has a function this, which depends on y. In other words, the farther away we are from the x-axis, the less dense, the closer we are, the, the greater the density, and is defined as k times 1 minus y which means at the x-axis, the wire has a density equal to k, halfway from 0 to 1, it's half k, and all the way at the very top, the density goes to 0. Well, that's not really realistic, but let's say it's very, very close to 0. Of course, the equation of a semicircle like that, x squared plus y squared equals 1, because the radius of the wire is equal to 1. And yes, we are going to use parametric equations. We're going to depend on the variable theta to make it easier to integrate. So if we're going to find the mass of that, the way we can figure that out is that the mass is going to be the integral of small little pieces of mass, small little dm. So if we take a small little region like that and we call that dm because the length of that is going to be equal to ds. And so what that means then is that this actually turns into what we call a line integral because this can be defined as the line integral about a curve, and here's the curve that we're going to integrate it at, of the density, and of course, how, how do we find dm? Well, dm can be defined as being the density times the length, which is going to be a ds. It's going to be an arc length along this line right here. So it's going to be a density times ds, and the density, of course, is defined as this function right here. So this is going to be equal to k, times the integral about the curve of 1 minus y times ds. So now that begins to look familiar because that looks pretty well what we've seen before. And of course the curve that we're going to use right here, the curve can be found by taking the equation x squared plus y squared is equal to 1. And so now this looks very familiar. Yes, this looks like a line integral format. So how can we do that? Well, first of all, what we can do is we can replace x and y for what they are in terms of the parametric variable theta. So we can say that x can be defined as the cosine of theta and y can be defined as the sine of theta. So we can go ahead and replace the y here by what y is equal to the sine of theta. Now ds, hmm ds, well that would be equal to r d theta, so what we can say here is that ds can be written as r d theta, but since r is equal to 1, since r is equal to 1, we can say that ds is equal to d theta, and yes, if we're going to integrate over d theta, the limits of integration are going to come from 0 all the way to 1. So that means that the mass can now be found by taking the integral and let's see here, I need a k on the outside, right, the k of 1 minus y, but since y is equal to sine of theta, I can write 1 minus the sine of theta, and ds is going to be d theta, and the limits of integration are going to go from 0 to pi, because it's a semicircle. And now we're ready to integrate. So this becomes equal to k times 1 times d theta integrated is simply theta, and the integral of the sine, let's see, the derivative of the sine is the cosine, so the integral is the negative sine, so it would be a uh, negative cosine, so it should be plus times the cosine of theta evaluated from 0 to pi. So let's go ahead and plug that in, and so we end up with k times, when we plug in the upper limit, we get pi plus the cosine of pi, while well, the cosine of pi, that's 180 degrees, that's a minus 1. And then subtract from that, when plugging the lower limit, which is 0, and the cosine of 0 is going to be a minus 1 as well. Let's see here, oh, it's going to be plus 1, sorry, plus 1. Okay, so now that looks like pi minus 1 minus 1, or pi minus 2, so ultimately the mass of this wire is going to be equal to k times pi minus 2. And so here is actually a realistic example of what a line integral is and how can it be applied in various ways. And here's one of them. That's how it's done.